we are also engaged in a transformation of our legal and penalty systems. So we're changing our laws to have stronger penalties, to reflect the priority that all Jamaicans place on public order and public safety and security. But it will look something like this. For capital murder, the penalty is death. If not applied, then life without parole. For non-capital murder, the penalty will now be, our proposal, the penalty will now be 45 years to life, or rather, life imprisonment, and you must serve 45 years before consideration of parole. There is, there is no question that somewhere over these many years, murderers have gotten it into their minds that the penalty for murder is not the death penalty. They have gotten it into their minds that the penalty for murder is not life imprisonment. And that somehow, with a good lawyer, they will be back out on the street to enjoy their life. Our penalty remains. If you take a life and you're convicted of such, your useful life should be taken. Bro, God, I will not take nothing serious that you said about 40 years to life, death penalty, and all them stuff. I will not take none of this seriously. Until the day when I see you prosecute somebody for that charge. Right now, there's a case going on right now with the Clogsman case with Blackman, Andre Blackman. If you can use this case right here to make an example of what you're preaching, I will believe you. I will believe you. Because you say one thing, and then the judge and the liar and then say one more thing like, oh, now listen to myself, I hear that. I talk about talk for the people and make the people and believe him. Well, I'm like, you are too here, you black man. So you can't come out and run and go do what you have to do. If that don't happen, and you, what you're preaching, saying that it's 25 or 40 years or 45 years of life or whatever, if that come in play with this case right here, I will believe you. You're not selling me no pussy in the bag. You're not selling me no pussy in a no bag. No more. Tired of it. 